All right, Brad, this is a problem we consider to be a epidemic. Yeah, right. Yes. We see this so often in young children is really bad posture. Right, right. Way beyond the years. Yeah. I'm adamant, if you're a parent, you've got to start addressing your child's posture when they're three years old or right in that age and get at them. That's you right. You don't sit at the supper table unless you're sitting Listen up Listen to tall. Brad. That's <laughs> we'll show you three things you could try. That's right. Bob and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. All right, the first thing got to fix, Brad, is their computer habits. That's right. If they have a laptop mm -hmm. or a desktop, it doesn't matter. They're sitting like this, right. looking. It just promotes and it really influences If the screen that. is down, yep. the head is going to follow. Yep. So it's too low. It's too low, and it's got a keyboard that's attached to the screen. Right. It's not a good scenario. Spend so, uh, 20 bucks. 20 yeah. bucks for a wireless or keyless yeah, keyboard. Yeah. Get your laptop and raise and it up. Raise it up. And then you're going to have to use a little uh, <clears throat> discipline and say you can't right. do your homework in your bed. You can't do it watching TV. Right. You got to have a designated location where the screen is up. And actually, that could go a little higher, but yep. it's much better than it was. Here's my keyboard here. And, and now he's straighter. Yep. Because there's a keyboard that's not pulling me in, and I can adjust it this way. I'll probably pull here. And actually, the keyboard. Put on your lap. Right, Looks you could even do good. that. Yep. Do, 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 do. Doing your homework, <laughs> do, do, do. you know, doing your, you know, when you're working in your English, we must have English majors, more English majors. Karen. Yeah, exactly Karen right. Helps. So, very good. That's the first one. All right, Brad, because the parent is going to have to harp on the child, <laughs> I, I figured we'd just give one exercise. Sure. And it's a simple one. Mm -hmm. You just need a rubber ball like a dodgeball. Yeah, one that's soft, not like a basketball. Right. Like six or eight inch diameter like this. And the good thing is a lot of kids have these laying around the house. Right. If not, go over to the neighbor's house. They'll have one. And still one, yeah. <laughs> this is kind this, of fun. It is. This is an exercise that children, I think, will like. Make a game out of it. Take this, put it behind your back. Between the shoulder blades, it may change up and down. Yeah, you can... Move it up and down. Yeah. And then just tell them, lean back, arms up, look up towards the ceiling, and stretch back over that ball. Adjust it up and down wherever it feels the best and work on that. For Ideally, um, several times a day. A yes. day. Yep. Not just once, but several times a day. You know, these habits that the children are going to form will pay off incredibly as far as their health. Oh, they will thank you. They're going <laughs> to breathe better, everything. They have ne less neck pain, less yeah. back pain. Right. Uh, and they're going to look better. You know? Absolutely. More confident. Exactly. We just cannot preach it enough. So anyways, let's go to the next one, Bob. All right. The last one, also very simple, Brad, mm -hmm. the phone. So this is what you see all the time. Yeah. So you got to bring the phone up. Yep. Shorten the arms. Bring it up like this. It's simple to do, yep. but keep a good posture and don't phone down to the phone. I mean, head down to the phone. Yeah, let me see. I just, I just want to show a little thing you could do with your kids to kind of teach them this. Sure. Have them go up against the wall like this so their butt's touching, their shoulder's touching, and their Good idea. Touching, and then have them work on their phone like that. Right. Then you can play on your phone as long as you want, as long as you maintain this posture. Very good. Yeah. Otherwise, you could, I don't know. Brad's going to get parent of the year. <laughs> <laughs> the kids will, the, the kids, kids are going to love you. They'll appreciate it yeah. 10 years from now. <laughs> that is it, Brad. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Take care of your kids. It's very important. Right. <laughs>